A Brooklyn man dead, shot 24 times by five police officers. They say self-defense. Others say no. Tracy Egan has a report, and here it is. A chalk outline and a wash of dried blood mark the spot where Luis Baez was shot and killed minutes after his mother summoned police. Rose Padilla told police her emotionally troubled son was cutting up her kitchen floor. And when they arrived, Luis Baez lunged at them. Then he climbed out the living room window under the fire escape. More police waited below. Henry Lopez watched. He was about this high, and they were trying to talk him down from here. And... The cops, they just grabbed the stairs, they picked it up, and they dropped him. He was about this low. They lowered him down first. He was about this low, and they dropped it, and then he just fell. He came up. I don't know if he still had the scissors in his hand. And they started hitting him with a club over here, hitting him with a club. I don't know if the scissors still dropped out of his hand. He jumped over. He jumped over, and just about here, he started going all crazy or something. And uh, they just uh, moved back and, uh, and opened fire on them. Rose Padilla followed her son's last moments. That when, uh, when, they, when he fell down, he hurt his legs and he jumped over. When he jumped over, he, she seen that they was going to fire at him, that she went like this not to. They just went on and fired on him. Is she saying then that the police murdered her son? Yeah. yeah. Police say Baez growled and lunged at them with scissors. Some witnesses still insist the shooting was not necessary. Well, I, they didn't have a shooting. There was no reason for him to shoot him. He wasn't approaching any of them then. And then when he fell, they still, they just stood there like this. And they still shot him? They still shot, shot him when he was on the ground. You would swear to that? Yes. Did you see them shoot him when he was on the ground? Yeah, shot him when he was on the ground too. How many times? Couldn't, couldn't keep up with the count. Inspector Frank Mendyke says the five officers surrounding Baez thought their lives were threatened. They fired 24 times. But the shots were almost simultaneous. The, the proof is that most of the witnesses thought only seven or eight shots were fired when in fact 24 were fired. Okay. But they were all fired at the, in the same time, so it sounded like only seven or eight. The police department will investigate the shooting, and the Brooklyn DA will routinely present the case to a grand jury. But Mrs. Padilla says nothing can make up for the loss of her only son. She hopes to return to Puerto Rico, where she says she'll remember Luis, but try to forget about the way he died. Roger.